Hey guys, it's Ray from Marvel Code 12 and EpicDroid.com, and we're here today to take a quick look at the Poetic Revolution case for the Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus. Now, unfortunately, getting the Note 10 Plus was not in our budget this year. That's a very expensive phone, and it was a little bit outside of our price range. Okay, it was a lot of bit outside of our price range. Fortunately, what we do have here is what they call a dummy device. Dummy devices are devices that are sent to case manufacturers and other accessory manufacturers so they can have these accessories available to ship when the real device starts shipping. For all intents and purposes, this here is a real Note 10 Plus. It just doesn't turn on. So this here is the Poetic Revolution. It is a very rugged case and it is meant to protect your device in just about any scenario. Now before we get too far into this video, I do want to clear one thing up real quick. This case does not come with a built-in screen protector. Poetic does usually ship these with a screen protector built-in. However, because of the built-in fingerprint sensor on the Note 10 Plus, they opted not to do it so it would not interfere with fingerprint scanning. Now this case is a two-piece case. It does have a TPU layer as well as a hard plastic shell and to put this on first you have to take it apart So there's a little notch right here in this corner And what you want to do is you want to put your fingernail or a coin or something down in that corner to pull that apart And then work your way around from the bottom so as you can see there, that was very difficult to get out, and that was difficult by design. They built it that way in order to protect your phone and to make sure that your phone is not falling out of this case by accident. Once you have it separated, you're going to take this piece, you're going to set it face down, and then once you have it face down, you're going to go and you're going to take your phone, and you want to make sure that you have the power and the volume buttons in first to prevent any damage to those. Now slide those in and push it down in the corners, and then you're going to take the case, flip this piece over, and then you're going to put it in. When you put it in, I recommend starting up at the top. You're going to push it up so it's snug, and then push the rest of it in. So a couple of things I want to point out on this case. The first thing I want to point out is the grip of it. They have a soft TPU layer here that's part of the case, and as when you're holding that, it's a very firm grip. It's very grippy. I don't want to say sticky. It's not quite sticky. It's smooth, but when you're holding it, it fits very comfortably, and it fits very snugly. It's not going to be slipping out of your hand, so you shouldn't be dropping your phone when you're using this case. Now, if by some chance you do happen to drop it, it does have these raised lips around the corners. So you do have these extra thick bumpers here. So when you hit those, it will hit the bumper and then there's a pocket of air on the inside and then your device. And so it hits those bumpers, then it hits the pocket of air and it gives your device that extra protection. And those are in all four corners. And if you look at it from the side, you can see here that the case does have that raised back. So it is fairly thick as far as cases go in order to provide that impact protection here as well. Now on the front of the device, you do have a very large raised lip, it goes across the top and the bottom, so you can drop that face down, or you can just set it down and you can slide around without having to worry about your screen getting scratched. As you can see here, there is this little cutout or notch across the top of the case that makes it so that you can use this front facing speaker without suffering any volume or quality loss. Also here up top, we do have some cutouts for the noise canceling mics. And then here on the bottom, we do have a cutout for the primary microphone. We have a cutout for your speaker and we have a cutout for the S Pen. Now, unfortunately, because this is a dummy device, it doesn't ship with an actual S Pen. But as you can see there, it is a notched cutout so that you can use that without any problems. Here we have the cutout for our USB-C charging port. As you can see, it's not actually a cutout so much as it is a charging port that does plug in so that fits into the port and it makes it so that you're not gonna be getting any water or dust into that charging port. Now this case is wireless charging compatible, so you don't actually have to pull that out every time. Just get a nice wireless charger, plop that down on it, and you'll be charging in no time at all. Here on this side, you do have your power, your volume up, and your volume down buttons. And unfortunately, because this is a dummy device, we can't test them for real, but as you can hear there, they're very clicky, and they maintain their natural responsiveness. Now here on the back, we do have the extra large cutout for the camera, the flash, and the other sensors. And we do have some feet here. Those feet do make it so that when you're setting this down, you can put that down and you don't have to worry about the plastic piece getting scratched up from resting on any uneven surfaces. Another thing here on the back is we do have this kickstand. Just stick your finger in that little notch right there and pull that down. And then you can use this. You can use it in landscape on either side. And then you can also use it in portrait. And then when you're done with the kickstand, you just put your finger in there, slide it down, and presto, you're good to go. As I said earlier, this is a very rugged case and it's a very protective case. It's an awesome case that I would definitely recommend. I've used this case on several other devices and I've always been impressed with it. It's a very affordable case and it goes for between $17 and $20 depending on the color choice that you go with. There's a black, a pink, and a blue option and the pink and the blue are a little bit more at this time. We'll have links to the video description down below where you can order one of these cases for yourself. If you have any questions about the Poetic Revolution, about Poetic's other products, or about the Note 10 Plus, please feel free to hit us up in the comment section down below and we'll reply as soon as we are available. If you've enjoyed this video and you want to see more like it, please remember to give us a thumbs up and to share it with your friends. And as always, just want to tell you guys thank you for watching, thank you for all your support, and you all have an awesome day.